Police in Clinton Township say when they found that child, they rushed him as soon as they could to the hospital, but there was little they could do. That child was pronounced dead at the hospital. Now we're learning where that child was found, but there are still a lot of unanswered questions in all of this. At the Sarah Villa Apartments in Clinton Township, a terrible sound was heard by some around 6 this morning. I just woke up because I heard screaming and I came outside and it was police everywhere, so I just walked my son to the bus and went to work. The timing of the scream she heard is when police found the body of a five-year-old boy. The discovery made at a playground at the Clinton Cooperative Apartment Complex just down the road from where the child lives. So close to home and it's just, it's a tragedy that no one wants to endure or face or hear. I see him get on and off the bus all the time. He's a little cute little boy. Those living close to the playground say the police spent hours at the scene trying to determine what happened. They were taking pictures investigating the playground over here. However, details of what exactly happened remain few at this time. Police are not saying at what time the child wandered from home or how he was able to get out. The family of the little boy also too overcome with grief to talk about what happened. That's just really sad because um, obviously nobody wants to lose a child. Clinton Township Police did not indicate anything in their initial news release that the death was suspicious. However, the case does remain open and active at this time. Dave Spencer on The Edge.